Hey everybody, it's Matthew with Z1 Motorsports and we are going to be talking about blow-off valves and diverter valves for the VR30 and the Nissan Z. So a few different options here in front of me, lots of various different parts and components, but what it really comes down to is you want to get some noise out of your turbos, you want to hear the blow-off valve when you're letting off the throttle, you want to hear that excess pressure boost and you want to get those noises out of your turbochargers. So there's a few options that we have here that, that can accomplish that for you and I'm going to walk through some of the more economical versions all the way up to some of the fancier options. We have a few options here in front of me of a couple of different kits for blow-off valve kits and then we have what we call our diverter valve to blow-off valve conversion kit and I'm going to start with that. So this right here is the diverter valve for the turbochargers on the VR30 specifically on the Z. What a lot of people may not realize is on the Q uh, it does not have even though it's also running a VR30 the VR30 in the Qs do not have diverter valves. So that's a unique feature on the Z and these diverter valves what they do is when you release the throttle on your car it diverts the excess boost back in through the system and because it's an enclosed system you don't get any audible noises which as car enthusiasts that's what we're looking for so this conversion kit is a very simple way to be able to get those blow off valve noises from your car so this diverter valve what it does is it uses some block off plates that we have engineered that go into your turbo and then these right here will relocate your diverter valve into a spot where it will allow that boost to vent to atmosphere and give you that audible noise that you're looking for. So that kit is an easy simple installation um, and it's uh, really plug and play. So a couple of the other options outside of the conversion kit to, to use your factory diverter valves is your more traditional blow off valve kits. We have HKS and we have TurboSmart here in front of me. Both of them are going to come with all the necessary hardware to install it on the car. You're going to have your silicone adapters and hoses. You're going to have some vacuum lines. You're going to have the uh, block off plates just like on the other kit. One of the other features that comes with our blow off valve kits is this diverter valve simulator. It's a plug and play option that plugs right into the harness that is going to simulate what the uh, ECU is looking for uh, to keep any dash lights off when you convert from a diverter valve to a blow off valve. So starting left to right, I'm going to uh, talk a little bit more about some of these individual blow off valve kits. Specifically, I'm gonna dive into our Z1 TurboSmart V-Port kit. So the reason I mentioned Z1 is TurboSmart has made some specific uh, V-Ports for Z1 for our kits. They have a laser etch Z1 here in the top of the blow-off valve itself. They all have a, a 38 millimeter aluminum piston and they're available in several different colors whether it's red, black, or blue. And we sell a lot of these in our Z1 kits. We run these in a lot of our cars. If you follow some of our media that we've done with things like boost season and you hear those blow off valves a lot of times they are uh, the Turbo Smart V port um, in our Z1 kits that we offer. Um, so great kit. Uh, it's a uh, gives you some customizability um, under the hood with some different colors and uh, we have a lot of success with with this kit on our cars. All right, now for those of you that are the dyed in the wool JDM fans, we all of course have the HKS. Uh, HKS, a great option for those that are looking for some customizability in the tone of your blow off valve sound, uh, the sound that you're getting. There's some inserts that you put in these. There's a couple of different colors that kind of help you identify which tone it is. There's kind of a high pitch and kind of a lower pitch tone depending on what insert you have. You can get the HKS in a black, kind of like a black anodized housing or this aluminum kind of a polished housing. But the HKS, uh, the unique feature there again is that you can kind of get some different pitch levels uh, dialed into that blow off valve kit. So depending on uh, what level of sound you want coming out of the car when you're shifting gears, um, you'll, you can do that with the HKS. Both of these options, whether it's HKS or Turbo Smart, are gonna be a great solution to help protect your turbos, keep them safe. You're not gonna get any of that compressor surge. And, uh, and then you get all the great sounds that come along with it. So three different options. You've got your diverter valve to blow off valve conversion kit, the HKS kit, and then the Z1 V-Port from Turbo Smart kit. So all three of these options are great for your VR30 and the new Z, whether you're wanting to just simply uh, make it so that your factory diverter valves are audible, or if you want some 
a little bit more noise and volume with the HKS. Uh, same thing with the Turbo Smarts, but with a little bit more of the color customizability under the hood. Uh, all three of these options are available at z1motorsports.com. When you are looking at the listings for these, be sure that you select the drop down if you're running factory turbos or our larger VRX70 turbos. There will be a difference in the hardware that comes with them depending on what you have. So check them out at z1motorsports.com and get those boost season sounds going. Uh -huh.